Hey guys, welcome back to another amazing video. Today, I'm gonna to show you one of my favorites, uh, and it's called deviled eggs. And <laughs> we've already boiled them, we've already uh, cut them in half, and I'm gonna show you how I prepare them. And I have a little secret trick that I've never used before, but I've been very interested about. So we're gonna try that today. And what I am talking about is everybody knows what a deviled egg is. Some people have it with mayonnaise, mustard, some to do it relish, and I don't do relish. Um, some people put onions in it. I'm not gonna put onions in it, but I am gonna put this in it. I'm gonna make the deviled eggs even more devilier, if that's a word. But before I get started, I wanna say thank you, thank you, thank you to all the new subscribers and all subscribers sticking around. Without you guys, this don't mean anything. And so if a lot of you guys, if you don't know what this is, this is a deviled ham chicken spread. It's a chicken. It's chicken. <laughs> so that's what's in it. Not really too much of anything. So we got our bowl. We're going to have to go ahead and start, like I said, I already cut them up. So we're going to get all the uh, yellow stuff in the bowl right quick. And I never had this, guys. You got to let me know, well, how's your favorite way to eat deviled eggs? Or do you even eat deviled eggs? Please put it in the comments uh, on how you eat deviled eggs. Uh, everybody has their own you know, way of doing it, special way of doing it, or whatever. Um, normally, uh, I do just mayonnaise, mustard, and uh, I put a little, I don't put paprika on mine. I put Cajun seasoning on mine, which to me brings it to that next level. And uh, I, I didn't bring that in, so we're going to have to go fix that. I'm going to have to go get it. All right. And I'm not, I don't go by, um, measurements maybe i should but i don't i just kind of eyeball it that's why i got this squirt uh mayonnaise right here and i'm almost out it looks looks empty it should be enough for just this little bit right here though all right we got all the uh we got all this in there right there okay now time for some of that Here's what it looks like. Does it look too appetizing? Normally, you put this on a um, on a uh, sandwich, but this this is what it looks like. It's a chicken spread. It's like you know, it's the consistency is oh man, it's that right there. Some people don't think it's appealing, but I think it's going to be pretty legit on here. I don't know. Maybe I'm stupid. I'd just be making a train wreck right here. I don't know, because I never had it. I'm not going to put the whole can on there, because that's enough right there. And I'll show you. Yep, and that's the can. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, does it smell good to me? Yes, it smells good, because I like deviled ham. And this, you got deviled ham, and you got the deviled, uh, deviled chicken spread. This is the deviled chicken spread. Deviled ham is, is, is a little bit more, spi uh, not spicier, but... A little bit more, I don't know how do you say it, just more hammy, I guess. So we're going to put a little bit of uh, mustard in there. Not much. That's good enough. Put some mayonnaise in up in there. Um, we'll do that for now, and we're going to taste it. So this is what it looks like now. <laughs> I don't know. Put a little bit of uh, pink salt up in there. And we may have to add a little bit more here and there. We got some pepper in there too. We gonna look like we gotta incorporate all this together and make it like a paste. If you have never made a deviled egg before, that's how it's done. <laughs> oh man, it does smell good to me. Mm -mm -mm. See what we're on time? Okay, we're at four minutes. Should be fine. Tell you what, I'm gonna get everything mixed up and I'll be right back, all right? Eventually. All right, we're back. Uh, we got it mixed up pretty good. I already put some in there and that's what it looks like. What do you think? I got some already filled in. I'm gonna fill in the rest. Um, I'm doing it the old country way and I gotta fix my camera. Doing it the old country way because I don't know a better way to do it and I don't have the tools for a better way to do it. <laughs> So we're just going to do it the old way that I've always grown up doing it. It looks good. 
It smells good. But will it be good? I don't know. I'm assuming that it will be. Since I like both, I think it's going to be fine. Um, but it all depends on if you like this stuff. Um, it's just chicken. I mean, I mean, it's nothing bad. It's just really chicken. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> I'm not the best, like... Uh, maker of deviled eggs that make them look like, oh my god, they're so fancy. No, that's not me. <laughs> but, you can't eat them. Alright, we're almost got one more. And we're almost done. It's almost time to top these things with some Cajun. And Alright. Let's see. Let me, hold on, be right back. Just wanted to wash my hands because I didn't want to uh, taste it while not being on video. Here's my Cajun seasoning. It's an old black pepper container. <laughs> Told you. About this. Ghetto as it gets here. Do, 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 do. I like a pretty decent amount of Cajun on mine. Not a lot. All right, guys. I did not have to put any more uh, um, mustard or mayonnaise in there, but. That's my thumbnail. I had to do it, make sure. Maybe that's my thumbnail. I don't know. All right. What do you guys think? All right. The heck with it. Let's try it. That kick, kicks it up a little bit better. Uh, kicks it up a notch or two. Makes it different. Makes it real different. Hmm. Blake, do you want to try one of these? No? Blake does not want to try it. He's playing his video game. I think they're legit. Um, it's a different way of eating them. Is it the best deviled egg out there? I don't know. Pretty close, though. I like it. Let me know. How do you guys eat your deviled eggs? This is pretty legit. Um, and that's all I put in it. Mayonnaise. Black pepper. Mustard. Pink salt. And not even a whole can of that. Um, I think it's pretty fire. You guys tell me what you think in the comments. I love you guys. Peace out next time.